Hi guys, I'm on holiday and I wanted to make a gameplay video since I've always wanted to record various um, playthroughs of games, particularly RPG ones uh, with story and um, sort of things like Dragon Age. Uh, but before I can do that, I need to test various settings with respect to video quality, audio quality, and so on because I've never done 60 FPS sort of um, gameplays. Um, well, the programming videos at 60 FPS don't really count because the content is slightly different. You don't have this fast-paced motion. So my logic was to pick some uh, something that has reasonably fast motion. Um, so like World War Z, where you have lots of things moving and if I can pick settings that work for this game, then I'm hoping these settings are going to work for slower paced games as well, um, like RPGs. And on that note, throughout this video, if you could um, pay attention to video quality and the audio volume, so my voice versus the game audio, because I don't want them to be too loud, either of them. And if you could then comment on those two things at the end of the video, that would be great. Thank you. Okay, let's go. So uh, this is World War Z. If you haven't played this, this is like a modern clone of um, Left 4 Dead. You have four teammates, well, there are four teammates in total, and you essentially progress through a level to destroy some zombies, depending on what type of uh, game you're playing, because there, there are different types. You've got the campaign mode, you've got uh, this thing, which is horde mode, uh, where you get lots of swarms of zombies uh, and you defend a specific building or two. So maybe we'll do two levels in this, uh, two waves as it were, and then that should be sufficient to judge the quality of various things. <clears throat> what differentiates this game from Left 4 Dead though, uh, this game has classes, which is pretty cool. You have classes of characters and weapons as well, and you can upgrade both of those things. So as you get more experience by destroying these, uh, by killing the zombies, you get more levels and you can upgrade various things related to that specific character. I don't know what my character is, it's the default one. Um, it's the sort of damage per second type of guy, I think. Uh, there's a medic, there's an explosives expert, and a few other types that I've not really explored. I've pretty much just picked this guy and used the default settings more or less. Um, and as you progress through the world, so you can buy a lot of interesting things like you get health, you can get um, more damage. Similarly, you can upgrade weapons um, and their stats. Okay, that's wave one done. Let's see if we can buy something a bit more advanced. Sniper rifle or crossbow. Let's go with crossbow. Hoping for more firepower, but that'll do.
There's also certainly more stuff uh, on the level uh, in this game compared to Left 4 Dead. So you have your secondary weapon, which is this pistol and a bunch of other things. You've got your primary weapon, like this crossbow, and you also got this heavy weapon, which does a lot of damage. Um, but it's a one use, as in once you've emptied your clip, uh, you'll need to find another weapon, another heavy weapon on the level. And there are also grenades, but I'm not sure if the grenades are the same for every class. I think depending on the class, your equipment type weapon differs. Like the explosives guy, I think they've got C4 or something like that. Well, I certainly am. The radius on that explosive is not great. Have to really hit them. Oops, sorry. All right, so wave two done. Um, let me know in the comments. Uh, well, two things: video quality and volume of audio. I can tweak those things to some extent. My primary concern about video quality is I don't want too large uh, file sizes because it's going to take ages to upload this to YouTube because I've got very slow internet connection. Audio is reasonably easy to fix. You just add um, positive negative gain depending on uh, which way it needs to go. And on that note, um, thanks for watching.